Hey everyone, welcome back to Super Mario 64, and I'm playing with my Elgato settings. In order to let you better hear sound, well, we're dreadfully going back to Hazy Maze Cave. Oh, I don't want to do the eight red coins, so I'm just going to get the... Might as well save the worst for last, you know what I mean? Well, let's do it, so... <clears throat> anyway... What I was attempting to do was, you know, avoid the copyright police. But, from what I noticed, you can't hear classic soundtracks when looking back at the videos, but, you know, I had to do it to avoid copyright. So, now what I'm going ahead and doing is I'm turning up the volume while turning up my mic. I should not have gone this way while turning up my mic volume, if that makes sense. So, while I'm talking, the um, game volume goes down a little bit, but you can still hear the game volume relatively well. So hopefully I can bypass the copyright with my voice, which is more than likely annoying, but who cares at this point? I really don't care what you like. You're here to see how to beat Mario 64. <clears throat> and I'm not the best channel for that. <laughs> well, who the hell cares? You're here anyway. Ugh. Now, this is the room I want to get in right here. Because this leads to a completely different star. So, you remember that star that was behind the cage? Well, I'm pretty sure I just got to it. Actually, no, not. I'm sure. I'm certain that I got to it. Yeah, see that? It's behind the cage. There's two doors in that little gas area. <laughs> the only other star left here is the, um... Is, um... Pretty much doing the, um... Jungle Gym. Oh, how I am going to... Actually, you know what? Let's get the 100 coins before the Jungle Gym. I know we say let's do it on 8 red coins. But here eight er here eight red coins doesn't necessarily matter a whole lot, considering the amount of uh, how to put it, coins that's ever prevalent. So I'm not gonna deal with uh, the eight red coins. That is just too big of a hassle that I'm not going to deal with. So while I'm here, I might as well you know get the coins. <clears throat> Well, anyway, uh, I've been kind of playing around with randomizers and I actually enjoy it, so I'm probably going to make an LP on that, especially with Ocarina of Time. Ocarina of Time comes right next to Mario 64. That's probably one of my favorite all-time games. I actually own two copies of Mario 64, or not, Mario, yeah, technically two copies of Mario 64, this Wii Shot version and the cartridge. Cartridge. But also, I own two copies of Ocarina of Time. I own the N64 version and the 3DS version. I've enjoyed playing those. Actually, I do want to go this way, despite Metal Mario not wanting to uh, go. But anyway, Ocarina of Time is just a defining thing for me. Like, Zelda's probably my favorite game series. Okay, I thought there was coins on that slide. I don't know why. <clears throat> but yeah. Ocarina of Time is probably my favorite Zelda game alongside Breath of the Wild. Breath of the Wild comes pretty close uh, with Ocarina of Time as one of my favorites in the Zelda franchise. Like, I just, I love, I love, I can't say it enough, I really just love Breath of the Wild. No! Well, that just screwed us on it, right? Or on, uh, the blue coin. That really screwed us, so you know what? We're, we are going to have to do the uh, 8 red coins to do the 100 coins. So let's just go ahead and do the jungle gym, get it out the way. That was really poor timing. Like, I hate those ditches too, because if you're Metal Mario and you're stuck in the ditch, you're screwed. You can't get those blue coins. Oh well. <laughs> well. That leaves us with only after we do this. Can I please see the door? Thank you. Well, after that, that only leaves us with um, 
two more stars to get, and we can get those at the same time. So, let's just go ahead and get the, uh... <laughs> let's get this Jungle Gym star, as I call it. That's all you do. You, if you're wondering how you get it, you get up here and you climb all the way over. You just hold A. And... Guide Mario. Oh, you do not want to go off that edge. That is a pit. And there we go. Now that only leaves the 100 coin star. And the 8 red coin star. Which I really want to do the eight red coin star last. What's in here? Is this a one up or did I just make? No, that's a that's a lamp. I thought that was an orange block. Oh, well, good eye on me. Yeah. But God Almighty, if it's anything that will piss me off in this game. And I like this. I don't get mad at a lot of things, but one thing that is a defining feature of complete bullshit in this game is the fact that that pit. And that slope. If you launch up and you screw up, you are dead no matter what. There is no amount of jumping and kicking that will save you from sliding to your impending doom. Like, ever. <laughs> if I ever wrote a review about this game, and this is what I was talking about this level, that is what I would bring up. Because that is awful. <sighs> now then, let's go back and go get the, uh... Blue coins... Oh my god, dude. Ouch, that hurt. Okay, well, you're dead. I don't get coins from y'all. Where are you at? You're right here, so I can go ahead and kill you, get some coins out of you. You too, give me some coins. Did I grab that coin? I did not hear it whatsoever on my screen, or on my... Uh, TV. Okay, here we go. Blue coin, blue coin, blue coin, blue coin. Okay, no more coins. Oh, speak of the devil. <laughs> Ow, you hurt so bad. Give me your coins. 65, that's not bad. That's not too shabby. Out of everything. That, that's not so bad. All things gap. Oh. Good lord. I am like actually just irritated over that 100 coin loss. Like, come on. I'm trying to record because my internet's out. I don't need to be getting pissed now. <laughs> I'm already irritated that I can't watch like videos or download anything or play any games with my friends because I lag out too much the way the internet's acting up at certain times of the day. It could be the usage of uh, how many people are on at a time. Because I know in the evening it gets really busy here. Like, I, like everyone gets on their consoles or their computers or whatnot. I can't complain about that considering I'm the one using my computer right now. But that's because I'm recording. Okay, there we go. Let's... I really, really, okay, actually, you know what, I have an idea. I have an idea. Oh, that was almost bad idea. <laughs> that was almost a really bad idea, but thankfully, it worked out. Oh my god. I am happy that worked out. Yikes. You know what I just realized? I could have hopped over from there. Oh god. Not the spicy meat the buzz. <laughs> Ow! That hurt! Like bad. Ugh. Like you can fall an infinite amount with Mario as long as you <laughs> As I was saying, as long as you ground pound at the right time, you're safe. Oh. Ooh, that hurts. But water heals you. Oh, yeah. How beautiful. The water heals all wounds. Together, yeah, there's not water in, like, so many certain levels. I feel like if there's any level I should have learned to, uh, remember, it's the last two of this game. 
And I'm not talking about Bowser, I'm talking about like the actual last two courses. Okay, that's 96 coins. 96. Now I'm sure, I'm fa in fact I'm positive, I could probably go to the uh, metal cap stage and grab those red coins and be happy with a 100 coin star I get there. But, you know, I kind of want to get done with this level and not do the red coins. So, let me hop back on the elevator. And wait for it to go back up. Yeah, if it's any process, I hate these elevators. I mean, yeah, it gets your game played longer, I guess. <laughs> it's like, what, two minutes extra play time that you can brag about? Please don't do what Nintendo did with this. Okay, so instead of long jumping over there like I was originally trying to do, I'm going to see if I can't... Oh, that's that, that worked. That worked. And you know what? I'm happy it worked. So let's go this way and get on the elevator down, and then we'll go do the uh, red coins. Okay, so you go back that way, and then voila, just two red coins, and we get the 100 coin star. Oh... <sighs> This has been a long process with the Hazy Maze Cave. I hate it so much. In fact, I can't wait to get into hell. You know, leave the lava land. A.K.A. hell. Uh. So, let's go. Oh, I should not have done that. Don't go that way. Don't go that way. That's someone we don't want to know. Alright, one more red coin. And there we go, 100 coin star. Yes! Finally. <laughs> yes, I love to save. Thank you, Mario. Oh god, that worked. That worked. That was a miracle. That worked. <laughs> Alright, let's go get this last coin. There's only a jump. Now, there's only two more, or four more coins to get. So let's see, two more. No, it's not two more. It's what is it? It's this jump pattern right there. You climb the pole because Mario is a pole dancer. And like that, we just do our shenanigans and get done with this level. Oh my god! I might cut out that one part. Nah, I'm not. I'm gonna leave it in. I'd rather people see failure and see someone who failed make progress than me cutting out my complete and utter blunder fest. If it's me taking forever on trying to figure something out, that's one thing. But if I fail, oh well. Like, I don't care who sees it. All that matters is I got it done. Like, that's one big thing in life. Like, it doesn't matter if you fail or not. You got it done. Anyway, let's hop over here, grab these last two. Get the hell out of here. Ugh, thank god we're done with this. It's better than what I attempted to do last video when we hit the big 5-0. Oh, I am happy. Like, beyond ecstatic that that is done. Yeah, I can open the uh, star door on the third floor. You know what? That's good. That's good. So that means we have access to... Okay, let's go to hell. But that means we have access to level 14 and... Not 13. 14 and 15. Don't be a pushover. Yeah, Nintendo tells you to bully back, guys. And I'll show you what I mean by that. Because in order to... Uh, get anywhere in this level, you have to navigate over... Well, before you can get the shell in this level to surf around in the lava. And this level's easy with the eight red coins. I love it. Okay. No, I don't. <laughs> Alright, that hurt, that hurt, that hurt. But luckily... Wow, okay. The coins! The coins saved me. Thank you, coins. But they saved me for this boss battle, right? Yikes. Never mind. See, the big bully pulled me in the lava. That means he's an asshole. 
You know, we do assholes. We punch back. <laughs> Don't actually take my advice. Ugh. Oh. Oh my god. Like, this level's probably the easiest in terms of layout, and I love it for that. It's not convoluted like Hazy Maze Cave, which, you know, supposed to be convoluted in a way, because, you know, it's a maze. It's. It, that's what's supposed to be. Like I said, it's a maze. But do you really think you could have, uh. <laughs> I'm playing Matador at this point. <laughs> that was funny. I can't tell if I Matador or if I backflipped a certain way and made him go into the uh, lava. I really can't tell. You know what? I think I have time for uh, one more star. And to do that, we have to go back over there. So that's easy. So you gotta bully the bullies, you know? Oh, they don't give it to you here either? Well, that was lucky. I almost, that almost fell. I guess you gotta do both of the bullies before they give you the uh, shell. Because there is a shell and actually... That's the wing cap over there, so... You know what? I'm gonna make this easy on us. Oh, that did not make it easy. In fact, it made me look retarded. But you know what? That don't matter, because... So you have this. We can practically go anywhere. So we can head over to the bullies right now. Which is where we're supposed to be going. Which, I like the fact we have access to the wing cap, but you gotta go past the bully and get over here. <clears throat> oh, please die. Now you have, we have. Oh, we got. We got a four. <laughs> no, Mario. That's not healthy. That's not how you practice safe sex. You don't get humped by these guys. Okay, that's one. That's one. No, dude. They are fast. Holy cow. There was two. I knew you could punch him at one point, but. Oh god, don't go sideways like that. <laughs> How'd you get the momentum to- Oh, I got one more bully to deal with. Oh, he's faster! He's faster, thank- Oh god. He's gonna break my butt. He's going to break my butt. <laughs> go away. You're not allowed there. You're not allowed to touch my butt. Go away. Okay, that was- I almost fell. <laughs> Alright. Now then. Oh, no. I absolutely refuse. Oh, motherfucker. How do you like that? <laughs>